Hey everybody, this is not a spring chicken today. Of course, we continue with the LA Auto Show. But, you know, here's some cool things. These press kits come in all shapes and sizes. Sometimes they come in a business card. But sometimes, okay, these press kits, well, two of them happen to be government owned. Ah! Oh, shit. Government owned. Government highly invested in. Highly oh. invested in. Does that make a difference? Yeah. Yes, it does. Even on the showrooms or when it comes to cars. But for now, we're going to bring old Kim on with comments on the headlines. She's scratching herself. Like and it's all over for the Republicans. Yes, because uh, the Republicans last night had the nuclear option put on them. The flea said because they had to stop Republican extremists from stopping Rep from Obama getting his judiciary appointments appointed, even though he's had more appointed than any other president in the last 20 years. And he has got 10% more than George Bush did and 7% more than Ronald Reagan did. And 13% and more than Bill Clinton, another Democrat, did. So, the, but they, they can't, Obamacare is such a disaster, in order to stop the litigation against it, they need the courts in their control. So the, the Democrats basically, oh, but as they promised, not, the country doesn't have to worry, because it's only to stop extremist Republicans from mm -hmm. stopping the judiciary system from being a failure. And they're not going to use it on anything else well, yeah, they intend to use it on anything that Obama needs to get stuff done. So, I mean, if they're, they're going to break, that means now there is no point in negotiations over the, um, the debt ceiling because Obama is just going to use the court system to allow him to use the 14th Amendment of the Constitution to abolish the debt ceiling, which means he can spend as much money as he wants to. Mm -hmm. And Kerry says, two central U.S. Latin policy over. Yeah. The Monroe Doctrine is, we, well, we, we have to stop interfering in those countries and let them run themselves. The, see, the only reason they're not totally in Russian or Chinese hands is because we're there, but now, uh, well, actually, Kerry got, he, he's on the wrong side of so many. I heard a person from uh, um, one of their, their college, military college over there said, we've never seen a guy that was more incompetent at a job than Kerry is. He said this guy, he said that, uh, you know, mm. he, he said the Botox he's putting in his face is going to his brain. Oh, no. Yeah. And yet another study links soda to yet another health problem. Yeah. This is, uh, they did the study. What it is is that the, the nanny people in Obamacare want you to stop using soda whatsoever. So this is one on top of the one they did last week, which is new news. They discovered now that too much soda can give you cancer now, besides making you fat. And it, it bad, it's bad for your bones, can give you cancer, can make you fat. And until they're able to ban soda entirely, no, they said, we don't want to ban soda entirely. We just want to take the artificial sweetener out of it, and we want to make it in smaller amounts and mm -hmm. no re and uh, no refillable. Mm -hmm. And U.S. Afghan bill offers concessions for each. And it, it failed entirely today, that. Uh, they know that Karzai is on his way out. Karzai now is, uh, he's wanting all kinds of things, no concessions. He's wanting things in order now to protect his backside when they throw him out of office in the next election. And the, the United States isn't going to give it to him because it, they, already, they already conceded Obama would make a public apology for our, our actions in Afghanistan, which went over really bad with the Senate. And Scotland breakaway vote, a risk to national security, Britain says. Yeah, and this is the latest thing. The, the problem comes, if you think a lot of things sound the same, they're not the same. It's just they're threatening. Uh, they're now, okay, they've been promising the Scots the right to become an independent country for decades, and now they have decided to remove that uh, they're thinking in Parliament about keeping them uh, as an occupied country like they do in Ireland now to give a part of Scotland can be free, but the rest of Scotland will be under British rule. What? Yep, they're not going to allow Scotland. Here's the problem is the North Sea is Scotland's territory. That's where all the oil is for Great Britain, and therefore uh, they need the North Sea oil, so they're not going to, they're going to allow you to have the really bad part of Scotland, you can keep with Scotland, and the other part of it will be... They wanted be a, a British rule for the tax. For the, the money, money, yeah. yeah. U.S. Afghan deal offers concessions for each. I know, she liked that one. She um, read it every, every 
Okay, the U.S. Oh, well, this twice. U.S. looks to Asian nations to build their own military. Again, and um, that one was also, uh, that, like I said, here the problem is when they have low news days, they go to this stuff over again, which is what happened this morning. This is also different than last week in, in the fact that Obama is getting, um, he's getting flack from our military about, uh, I, Obama has no authority under the Constitution to grant any of this stuff. The, these countries had constitutions written by our military and, and, and Harry Truman after World War II that totally prohibits them to have military forces except for, okay, what's the Godzilla movies? Those are national self-defense forces in the Godzilla movies. Those are not a military that is offensive, they're totally defensive which is why they can't beat Godzilla. My, that might be it. Obama, remember, Democrats think that everything they see in movies for real, they may actually think that Godzilla every two or three years attacks Japan and they need an offensive force to protect themselves from Godzilla. And the rise of a giant solar power plant in California's Central Plain. Yeah, and this, um, this is even worse than it was a week ago. They said Why would they do? They need another $5 billion this week. Oh, another $5 billion? Another $5 million because, uh, $5 billion because it, it's costing more than they originally figured. And it's not going to supply the power usage that they originally figured. So in order to make it work, they have to triple the facility size, which means they have to, they have to use the power of eminent domain to kick San Joaquin farmers off their property, which is all, it's the agricultural belt of California and they're using it to put a solar farm on. And they're taking water from the canal system that is needed to water the, the agriculture. agricultural area to provide. But they said the benefits of the power plant will be so much better because you'll be able to have a cheaper heat electricity, which you won't because it's going to cost you more than things. And you'll be able to have a, you know, a more on demand because of power shortages. And it will reduce and lower profits, lower pro costs well, because the water is going to cost more for the farmers, there's going to be less ground and agricultural, the Hispanics that are depending upon the work, it, it, it's, it's a total disaster and the Democrats know it. And isn't that the largest agricultural area in the world? Yeah. It's yeah. the richest agricultural area in the world because of the, of the soil content allows them to grow. The soil content and weather can grow three crops a year in the area without having to, ha to utilize heavy amounts of fertilizer because it's like all volcanic stuff. Mm -hmm. And Obama is about to destroy the agricultural center of the United States so that... I it know, can't they go somewhere else? No. The problem is you have to have lots of ground and water. They have the farmer's ground which they, they can seize and they have the, they have the California aqueduct. Oh! It's, it's why when you see him talking about uh, the uh, solar energy only works if you have access to water. Which means all those places in the desert that you think would be primed aren't primed because, because of water. Because you can't get water to it. And um, like the, they have one outside of Las Vegas, Nevada that we drive that keeps expanding. There's no water there. None. The water is like 20 miles from there. And uh, uh, basically in order to make it work, they're going to have to pipe water in from uh, the system that goes to Hoover Dam, which is actually owned by the state of California and it has to cross land, Bureau of Land Management ground to get to the power plant and the Bureau of Land Management really doesn't care about these greedy people. In Obamacare 101, why do men need to buy maternity coverage? I know. You have to buy maternity coverage. You've got to buy, I mean, like, the, the funny That's thing right. Again, if everybody gets maternity coverage, Everybody it's gets maternity coverage added to it. This is why they said that they said Obama knew when he said that they could reinstitute the policies it couldn't be done because Obamacare, the law Obamacare prohibits the policies that they're he's saying that they can reissue. Nine democratically controlled states have already said that you cannot um, go to it because it's illegal. And a Monty bubble is something the Mark Twain of the animal kingdom. Uh, basically you can only repackage the same lies so many times. No, otherwise you have to wait for it to go to the Yeah,